I had a request for the Lewis structure of acetaldehyde, CH3CHO, but it's kind of a difficult thing to do unless you already know what an aldehyde is. An aldehyde is when you have a carbon chain, although the carbon chain can be as little as one carbon atom. And then this HO is due to a double bonded O and an H at the end of the carbon chain. There could have been like three, four, five, up to a hundred of these carbons. You wouldn't have to draw it for a hundred, but a carbon chain and it ends with a double bonded O and an H, that's what makes it an aldehyde. Then you've got to figure out what is also connected to the rest of the chain. Here it's easy, that end carbon has three hydrogens on it. So you draw a hydrogen there, a hydrogen there, and a hydrogen there. And the only other thing to worry about is lone pairs, but carbon and hydrogen generally don't have lone pairs in Lewis structures. Nitrogens generally have one lone pair. Oxygen generally has two lone pairs, and that actually helps us complete the octet on oxygen there. This is the Lewis structure for acetaldehyde, but I haven't counted electrons, etc., etc., to help you do it. I will do that just in a moment. If you want your complete structure, though, you're done already, right? Each carbon brings four valence electrons with it, and there's two carbons here, so two carbons, four electrons each. Hydrogen brings one valence electron with it. There's four of them here, so that's four atoms bringing one each. And oxygen brings six valence electrons with it. So that's one atom bringing six electrons. When I add all these up, eight plus four plus six is 18 electrons. Let me double check that. Eight and four and six is 18 electrons. Yeah, that's right. And now we'll count the electrons that are in this structure. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, and then 16, 18. So I have accounted for all the electrons here. This is the structure, and there's not really a way you could guess that the oxygen was double bonded at the end unless you already knew what aldehyde meant. Cool, thanks for being with me, and best of luck.